hello earth signs welcome back to my channel thank you guys so much for your likes your comments your shares and subscribe i truly appreciate them all okay so i'm doing something a little different um i'm gonna pull one card for each sign to see what you could do to give yourself more loves more self-care this week okay to improve your life overall or for taurus one card for taurus please okay so Taurus needs to connect with the earth and drink some tea. <laughs> so herbal tea will be good for you. Uh, you don't have to go out in nature if you don't want to. Uh, you can definitely just drink some herbal tea. This could have something to do with you just overall relaxing, being at peace of mind or something like that. But grounding yourself basically. Okay. Yeah, maybe your chakras are out of alignment or something. Drink some tea, be at peace. Take a moment for yourself. Uh, Capricorn, what about you, Capricorn? What can you do for this, to improve yourself this week? <sighs> Yo, Capricorn. I don't even want to show this card because that's the first thought I thought of. And I'm like, Capricorn is, please, okay? Capricorn be getting it in. Ain't no way. But apparently, you you might need to get you some this week, Capricorn. <laughs> okay. Uh, don't shoot the messenger. Yeah. So, yeah, that might help you relieve stress, Capricorn. Yeah, that's going to help you ground your root chakra. That sounds like a lot of fun, Capricorn. <laughs> like, how come ain't nobody else get that card but you? That's wild as hell. Well, you are, you know. Anyway, moving forward. <laughs> oh, boy. So, relations, okay? Virgo, Lord have mercy. What you, what you, what you got going on? So, nurture your temple. So, vegetables, fruits, healthy stuff, okay? Honor your vessel this week. Beauty rituals. So, facial masks. Um, you know, do beauty routines and stuff like that for yourself this week. Okay? But out the gate. Capricorn on some bullshit already. It's like, no. <laughs> No, I'm messing with you, Capricorn. All right, let's see what you got going on. Oh, I have mercy. Okay, so I'm feeling like this somebody. Okay, especially for this Capricorn, whoever this is, you don't want to have relations until you have relations with somebody in particular. You want to have relations with that person. Okay, so you might have an opportunity this week to have relations with that person you want to have relations with. Okay. Strong masculine energy. It's like a masculine, like, no, I'm not I'm not about to waste my on none of y'all. I know who I'm gonna, you know, then I'ma wait until I get to her energy. Like so you could be detoxing or you have detoxed your body or something. All right, but there could be whatever though. I ain't going to get all of your business, Capricorn, but I'm seeing a lot, and I shouldn't be that far in your business. Anyway, moving forward. And if you're a feminine Capricorn, same thing, okay? Maybe it's been a while for you, okay? Moving forward. Uh, yeah, guidance. So you're being guided. A lost loved one is watching over you. Why somebody? Yeah, date night. So somebody's guiding somebody right now, okay? Date night. Get ready to be wined and dying. Okay, some romantic stuff. Look at y'all. I feel like a door has opened up for you, okay, this week. And you feel it or something, you know it's open. A door has opened up for you. So, yeah, if you was on the outs with somebody, this in particular person you want to deal with somebody and whoever y'all is, you might have an opportunity to deal with this person this week or you will have this opportunity because your ancestors is guiding you. Yeah, patience was needed. It was only just a matter of time. Kind of energy. <laughs> Whatever though. I'm not about to... You got your ancestors put, helping you and shit. What kind of shit is this? Whatever though. Moving. Okay, so they are guide, guiding you to change resonance because somebody all in your fucking business... Okay, somebody could be spying on you, trying to find out what you manifesting or something. You could be manifesting a change residence. 
Mercury, I told you something. Luck is on your side. Yes. Yeah, so somebody, yep, they expecting you to listen to your intuition about this air sign. They are opening their heart. Even though somebody is trying to sabotage you, it's like some, your ancestor or whoever you, you got, if you're dealing with an air sign or want to deal with this person, there is somebody in your energy that's trying to block somebody from being in your life or something like that. And your ancestors is blocking them, okay? You could be moving or you could be already, yeah, they telling you luck is on your side. Yeah, so there, you could have been expecting luck to be on your side, okay? Whoever you are, you was expecting luck to be on your side this week or something. Or you wasn't, but your ancestors said, I got you, like, okay? Things is getting serious, yeah. Somebody was being sneaky. Whoever you letting go, making room for the new, they was being sneaky because they know you want to commit to somebody. Things is getting serious, all right, in this situation when it comes to this individual. <clears throat> yeah, somebody is trying to keep you stuck with them or stuck in a commitment, stuck in something. And your ancestors is like, oh, uh-uh, okay? Your past told the love was like, uh-uh. So, things is getting serious because luck is on your side. Yeah, maybe you change resonance and your ancestors is guiding somebody to open a heart to you. Maybe you moved out or something. Your, uh, earth sign. You could have moved somewhere. Yep, reconsidering your alliances. Okay, autumn was the last chance or your last chance. Somebody knew that June was your last chance to do something. June 14th. Could have been your last chance to do something and somebody tried to stop you from doing something and your ancestors could have stepped in. You could be doing like a black widow. Something significant about spiders or whatever. <sighs> Let's see. What is this? Yeah. Somebody definitely was trying to cause drama. <laughs> a sewer mate <laughs> that you needed some space from. <gasps> Lord. Uh, so they might be trying to have relations. Why I'm feeling deja vu right now. Uh, Earth sign. Uh, I know I ain't do this before. Okay. But whatever this is, it's going to feel like that. Like when you around somebody, okay, so you could be going back around to somebody. It's going to feel like deja vu. Or they going to be like, here we go again. Or you like, oh my gosh. Okay. Or it's going to be different this time. Because somebody trying to cause drama, whoever the sewer mating is. But change is natural and good because this is the person. I don't know who this person is on your ass like this. But baby, either you, she like, you only want me energy. Whoever, if you're a masculine, especially with that sex card energy, you Capricorn masculine, you got to check here. She is the way. She's doing too much. She was doing too much. She was expecting to drag something out, but your ancestors is like blocking her or something. Because they know, yep, he was canceled. Because she, they know what you're trying to do or something. Yep. So every midnight, like clockwork, <laughs> she could be all in your energy trying to stop you. It could be a female, okay, passed over loved one for some of y'all that's helping you. Okay. Child, I done did all of that without the overall energy. What's the overall energy y'all reading, child? I went back. So what's happening? Look at look, look So I went out of sequence. So that song by Bryson Teller, Sequence, that could be significant to you guys, okay, at this time. And then secondly, I went out of sequence because they're doing something in her blind spot. So how I'm reading the messages, she would never, she could she wouldn't be able to figure this out, how your ancestors is setting something up for you. Like they're meticulous, meticulous, child, meticulously putting something together for you. It's like they doing something. And then that Mercury energy, it got something to do with communication. It got something to, so, um, somebody tried to cause blockages and obstacles with communication or something, or somebody blocked you or whatever. It, I don't know who this sewer maiden is, but maybe she been in your energy, like doing the most. Okay. The most, the absolute most. And she don't want to let you go or something. But your ancestors like, I bet you the fuck you would, energy. Like, I bet you you would. Oof. What's this? Oh, snap. What am I doing? Yeah. Okay. This was in a... Lovers in the reverse. This person is a karmic of yours. Yeah, it's over. 
It's over for this karmic. Death card to the strength card. You found your strength, Emperor. I knew it. So you manifesting your person. So whoever she is, she can't hold you down. Okay. I don't know what's going on with her. But she better go ahead over her life. She is on you though. Obsessive, possessive, controlling energy. Like, ew. What's y'all overall energy? Okay. Seem like, hello, Empress. That's your overall energy, your divine feminine. If you this Empress, okay, you could be, you could have Libra or Taurus or in your chart or something like that. But I feel like it's all about your divine Empress this week. Yeah, taking this leap of faith with your Empress. The full card in the Empress star. Yeah, which granted? Sun card. Somebody, yeah, somebody is seeing this Emperor. There you are. You could be a magician. You manifesting this reconciliation. You could have manifested this on the full moon. What moon we just passed? I think it's the full moon, right, y'all? You manifested this reconciliation. And here it is. Okay. Here it is. What's the Empress? What about the Empress? Oh, they was trying to take something from you. Yeah. We got the thief of a lover. We got Empress and house. An Empress's house. Empress real estate. They property. Something about their family. Somebody in their yeah, Empress's family is a thief. They tried to take away their love. And now they're under judgment. We got a court official, a counselor, or authority. Something about... Somebody that's held in high honor. Maybe somebody don't want you to be held in high honor. When it comes to this love, somebody is a good match for you. Your empress is love, but there's somebody in their family or your family that tried to steal your true love or your love from you or something. For money or because they know unexpected money come with this courtship and it's been like a long journey for y'all. All right. Okay. Okay. So you might be going to the Empress's house. Okay. Something like that. And they could have tried to, some whoever she is, who the sewer man? Somebody's a sewer man in y'all energy, male or female. Take these messages, it resonates. But they was really trying to take something from you. They really was. It was like a thing. But your guardian angels is telling you something. Luck is on your side. Also, I'm getting you moving out of a, your family's house, your mother's family house. Like, you you know how they have houses that be, like, um, passed down or something like that? Somebody's moving out of that house now. For some of y'all. Take it as it resonates, though, or sign. Let's see, though. Let's see what you going, what's going on for y'all this week. Somebody is sad. Somebody that tried to cause a stalemate for you is going to be sad. Like, they feeling it's going to be hurt this week. Mm-hmm. To see you in this two of cups. So, you definitely coming into union this week with somebody. They scared. <clears throat> they scared you going to come into union with somebody this week. Earth sign. You got somebody shook. Could be a Gemini. What's going on? How is the word you this week? And then also, like, somebody gonna try to cause uh, drama for y'all this week, but they ain't gonna, uh, not about a house. Mm -mm. Maybe the house belonged to the Empress. So, like, something is, 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 somebody gonna try to do some weird shit. Yeah, full card. So, you can be taking this leap of faith this week. Yeah, you got the strength this week to take this leap of faith. All right. 
maybe your ancestors is, is assured you it's a yes for you. So, yeah. <clears throat> How, uh, it's coming in? Earth signs, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. Earth signs. The King of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. What? What? Are you serious? I don't know. Who the King of Wands? Why? Why did it? Why my King of Cups and the Queen of Queen of Pentacles cause the ending for the King of Wands? What they got to do with anything? For wishes? What did somebody sacrifice somebody? They were stupid enough to sacrifice somebody. For somebody, oh, somebody, truth is going to be spoken this week about something. Maybe that's why somebody need to ground themselves. They're going to be all over the place. Or is y'all breaking up with somebody? Queen of Pentacles, maybe you breaking up with this person. Okay, so you can leave somebody behind. Like I don't know what the King of Wands got to do with something, but something came to a complete end for them. What is the obstacle here? The death. So some death. What? What? Or something is over now for this this Capricorn, this Queen of Pentacles, or a wife. The death card. Something is over. <sighs> what is happening? I don't like it. So drama about an ending. Is somebody gonna try to hurt the Queen of Pentacles this week or something, child? What's that? Um. That's why somebody changing residence or something for some of y'all. <clears throat> Your shit getting serious. Mm -mm. Y'all always got some underlying. Yeah, man. So somebody know a cycle is over. The sun card to the world. Yeah. Something probably going to be seen about what somebody was invested in because somebody found out information or how somebody tried to sabotage something in secret. <sighs> Yeah, and they're going to be sad and regret Scorpio energy. So the cycle is over. Somebody is very sad. Okay, full card. Taking this leap of faith. Knight of Pentacles. Somebody tried to slow a message down. That's funny because I was going to do the other signs before you guys and something told me to do y'all first. Okay. <clears throat> somebody didn't want y'all to have a weekly reading because they don't want you to know something or somebody didn't want something to be exposed in the weeklies for y'all this week. Well, on my channel, if somebody know that y'all watch my channel or something like that, what's the Knight of Pentacles? <clears throat> yep, but it backfired. <laughs> Will of Fortune. That's why something is going in your favor. A king of wands could have took some sort of action with this king of pentacles or will be taking some sort of passionate action towards a king of pentacles for blocking their lover. Or causing a stalemate for a lover situation. So you might have a little debacle this week with somebody. You could be a Taurus. What's the tower? Scorpio, what's the tower? <clears throat> something after a long time, something finally coming out. What's the tower? Somebody shocked about the information they finding out about the King of Pentacles. And why they missed the opportunity. They all in their head. Because they didn't know that this would cause imbalances to their friendship or to their celebrations if they lied to the higher fence. About having a one night stand with somebody or secretly doing something. What's the King of Cups? They didn't know that it would mess them up. You know, they just was trying to take something away from somebody. What's the King of Cups? So somebody could be in their feelings this week. Who the King of Cups? The Four of Cups. They're bored with somebody offer. They don't want to deal with somebody. Four of Cups. The Queen of Cups, damn. They don't want to deal with the Queen of Cups or 
they don't they're bored with the queen of cups or they're not really attracted to the queen of cups they rather move on somebody want to move on now or they missed the opportunity with the queen of cups because they had relations with a high priestess in secret or something just to get a one up over somebody and that's why the cycle came to an end of them communicating something they're under judgment somebody's very mad in secret somebody's pissed off about a secret somebody kept who the queen of cups king of, king of cups is kind of bored with the offer or don't want to do the work with or with the queen of cups who the queen of cups the king of wands judgment <clears throat> it's calling judgment the devil they are very upset this week, somebody, if you know, somebody really in their feelings. A king of wands could be really in their feelings right now. Because they missed this opportunity because of uh, somebody else, a king of cups or something. They feel like they missed the opportunity because of something. The action somebody took. Too many damn people. We got a king and queen of cups and a king of wands and a king of pentacles. That's a lot of people already. So it's three masculines and a female involved in this situation. Okay, the obstacle is the death card. It's the ending of a glamour or a drama or something. Death, the obstacle is a death. The world card. This message really got somebody feeling bummed about what they wished on somebody. Somebody could have been wishing death on somebody and whatever information they found out, they regret doing that now. Because they realized they fucked up. They sabotaged themselves. Eight of Wands. Because somebody could be in love with somebody. Maybe somebody tried to do a love strong a strong ass love spell. Or something like that. <clears throat> What's the sun? Something came to light. The outcome is somebody being exposed or you're going to be happy about something. What's the sun? Or something is being exposed about a sewer meeting. The sun. Yeah, there's no future for somebody. Yeah. Somebody can be protecting themselves. They had the strength to protect themselves. What's this three of wands in a reverse? Something also is coming to light. You don't got to wait for something. Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. This was a bad investment. Somebody telling somebody this was a poor investment. Oh, man. <clears throat> somebody could be drinking. They could have lost everything. Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. This was a bad investment. Yeah. To not give. So somebody was supposed to give up on another lover or to give up your lover or soulmate or whatever this is. Oh, somebody is unapologetic right now. A hierophant knows that somebody manipulated them or a magician and a hierophant is looking at somebody that didn't want to give up doing something. This is bad news, though. For a queen of wands, because now things are changing or somebody's confident things are going to change now. Seven of Pentacles, this is somebody not getting a return on investment. You reap what you sow. Somebody don't have no future because you reap what you sow. Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. One card, please. Queen of Pentacles. So you reap what you sow. This Queen of Pentacles wanted to win at all costs. And that's why something is changing now. Or they feel defeated because something is changing now. Yeah, and they can't get out of something. Somebody see you about to go towards this Empress. Because now you know the truth. You found out more information and they scared that they you leaving them out in the cold. You could have walked away from a plan that you, everybody had a plan or something. Somebody walked away from the plan. Yep. And she was mad that you walked away from her. So she wanted revenge, whoever this Queen of Pentacles was. Yeah. Oh. Somebody was mad at somebody, so she wanted revenge. It could have been a married. Y'all could be married to this person. You got the king and queen of cups, king and queen of pentacles, energy, and a fire sign. 
She could have been two couples, honey. I don't know, child. All blockages are removed, though. Like I said, they see somebody move past all the obstacles. So these people was putting up blockages for y'all, putting space between you and somebody. <clears throat> I don't know. Somebody can't stop missing you? A Latin man or a woman? It wasn't just sex. They only wanted money. What the hell? I, first face, middle initial, yours, theirs. A Capricorn on a new moon. Somebody could be a part of an organization, secret society, or whatever, Kevin. A Leo. Could have stole some mail. Oh. They tried to catfish you, but you realized it was them. The celebrity is stalking you. Everything is backfiring on them and a group. Whoever this person is, that's a part of an organization. So really bad karma could be coming because somebody lied. Like say somebody, somebody could have came to a group of people and lied on somebody that they had beef with. They just didn't like somebody, whatever this is. Okay. And they went to this organization lying to these people about this person and really bad stuff is happening to people. And it's all because of a lie that somebody said about somebody just because they didn't like them. Yeah. Really bad, bad, bad things is happening to somebody. Somebody was supposed to tell the truth or fix something, but they didn't. By in June, they didn't. She thought she could get away with it or something. <clears throat> somebody could do drugs. A fake friend. They could drink. They could drink. They could pop pills or be a drug addict. They could be your fake friend. Yeah, they wasn't honest with you from the beginning. They wanted you to just move on from somebody or something like that. That was all. <sighs> yeah. You single. So somebody knew somebody was single. Somebody with dreads or braids. Okay, he or she was a Hebrew Israelite in the springtime five years ago. Okay, this weekend. Okay, B. Somebody can read from the BK. Somebody want to know what's your new number. You don't need their new number. They already got your number or somebody, you have this Libra number already. All right. <clears throat> somebody is not 100. They not LGBTQ or something like that. Somebody could be in love with you for real, for real. A man with dreads or braids. The police is watching them. A Taurus. The police is watching a Taurus. There's no unfinished business in love with a water sign. They about to ghost you. Heart chakra magic backfiring. They know They know you know what they did to you. Love always wins. Dad. There could have been a physical or verbal abuse happening with somebody. He or she was, he was mad because she walked away and he wanted revenge. Now somebody all in their head and feelings. They could have did something. They wanted revenge on somebody because somebody walked away. They did dream magic on someone, but they were protected. A karmic woman did dream magic on somebody. A, what, a Caucasian man or a woman. They wanted to be with you bad. Jesus. They've been having a lot of dreams about you. They feel like they did a horrible job. Yeah, religious belief systems could have gotten away with something. <clears throat> yeah, we got Libra. So somebody had religious belief systems about this Libra. Mm -hmm. Strong Libra, you had it in your um, chart today. Maybe somebody knew somebody wanted to be with somebody. A Gemini, Dominican man or a woman was planning to rob you. Everybody backing out. Everybody knew this person was pressed about you. An earth sign in the summertime. L. Somebody is a star sea earth angel. Yeah, they knew that. A Pisces D. O. An Aquarius. Somebody could be an RN, CNA, or a doctor, or anything to do with child protective services. You was never the one for somebody or something like that. Somebody has a divine bodyguard. 
You didn't lose somebody for good like they thought you did, okay? Them hexes and curses backfiring on them. I hope this helped.